Look at this, a wedge tornado a mile wide at one point. Now, our Mike Bettis and some of his crew were tossed 200 yards by this tornado in El Reno. Fortunately, everyone did survive, and we're certainly thankful for that. One team member does remain hospitalized, but is expected to make it out okay. The Weather Channel's Dave Malkoff brings us the story. This vehicle known as the NBC Blue Mobile is named for the late David Bloom having survived the initial invasion into Iraq in 2003. This was the satellite uplink they used. It's trash now, but take a look at the vehicle Mike Bettis was in. You have to go faster. Go as fast as you possibly can. The Tornado Hunt crew is Kevin, K-E-V-I-N, Brad Reynolds. Yeah, it's Cleve, C-L-E-V-E. -E. It's just J.K. Cow. Okay, everybody duck down. One other cameraman hurt badly enough to be in the hospital still, and veteran Weather Channel meteorologist Mike Bettis, all trying unsuccessfully to run away from a tornado. So I was in the passenger seat, and we had two cameramen in the vehicle with us. I was shooting out, out of the side of the window. Eventually, the camera was ejected. This is the camera. It never stopped recording. Watch it here as you can actually see Bettis' truck rolling over and over in the field. The tornado had lifted them up. I don't know for sure, but I think they went at least 20 feet in the air, maybe 30 feet. And there was a moment where um, we were kind of weightless, uh, and I knew we were in the air. And it felt like forever. And then I had this moment where I tr truly felt like I was maybe I was going to heaven. We've had this vehicle twice to Iraq, so that's not the safest place in the world. But this was definitely right up there on the scale. Viewers may not know this, but you were just married about six months ago. You said that you thought about your wife. Well, what is it that you thought about when you were up there? Um, good question, Dave. I know Jerk. It's tough. I know it's tough. Jerk. <laughs> um, you know, I just saw I just saw my wife's face, and I thought, you know, that's you know that's my life. Uh, and I don't want to give that up just yet. And, and thankfully, I don't have to. Today, it's just time to go, wow, you know, what happened? And be glad that everybody's okay. Definitely an outpouring of support for Mike Bettis and the entire crew who came this close to disaster in that tornado. In Lawton, Oklahoma, I'm Dave Malkoff, The Weather Channel.